cell phone hacking charger attacks. When you have access to a person's office, but not necessarily their cell phone, swapping out their charger is a great way to attack them. This is a cell phone charger that looks pretty innocuous, but it's been modified so that it takes a micro SD card and will mount a USB storage device. As a result, when the person that you're attempting to attack plugs their cell phone into the USB port, the device initiates a connection, duplicates the content of their micro SD card in their phone, and stores it onto this micro SD card for later reclaiming. By doing so, you're not going to get necessarily access to the latest versions of their contacts, but most users have backed up their contacts to a VCF file on their local storage. It's also going to get you access to all of their pictures, any of the data from any of their apps, and a whole bunch of other information. There are larger versions of this device that include the carrier-specific duplication software that is like when you go to the Sprint store and they back up your contacts. They have versions of this device that will do that, but because they are carrier and awfully often phone specific, they're not as good for a general purpose device as this particular device that simply mounts the device as a USB mass storage device and copies it to the local SD card. Uh, this is a very small piece of equipment. It's very innocuous. If you didn't know how to find the micro SD card, you probably wouldn't see it. You simply leave it in the person's office plugged in. When they jack in to charge their phone, they may think that it's odd that they don't remember having a charger, but most people won't give it a second thought. And you simply come back the next day or in two days and pick up the charger. The only risk is that someone actually decides that they're going to take the charger with them in the car or on the, you know, to their home, and you've lost the device and possibly given the person an indication that something's wrong if they start looking into what is the device. But that's generally pretty low risk since most of us don't give two thoughts to what charger we're using, we just plug into anything.